What is going on guys? We are back with our part two of the Let's Play series of Salasta Crown of the Magister, a D&D styled 5.1 rule set where you manage a part of your four and you go on an epic adventure, which we haven't yet got to. We're, this is part two and we are still doing the very early parts of the game. So in the last part, part one, we made our four characters. We made a rogue, a wizard, uh, a warrior and a paladin. And we did the first two introductory quests, which was the, the first two characters that we made. So in this next part, we're going to be doing the next two characters and starting the, the main campaign story. So yeah, I hope you enjoy this one and I will catch you at the end. A bunch of nabby pambies. You're lucky you weren't attacked by Sorax. Who the fuck's that? Who's that? That's right, mate. It's always good to be lucky. The Badlands are thick. Why has he got a textured beard and we haven't? What, what have we done wrong? Go here? easy on him. He's just a harmless old drunk. Probably saw lizard folk or dragonborn or something. You think I don't know the difference? All those spines on their backs, those jaws. You've never seen anything like it. Not lizard folk, not troglodyte, not, not dragonborn. dragonborn. I'm telling you. No one believes in Sorax anymore. What's a Sorax? A of, Einar, of course. There's a Sorak under every bed, if you believe them. Easy now. Don't mock people for their faith. Read them I books. love having my characters Soraks that I've made. are masters of deception, infiltration. Anyone here could be a Sorak. Are you we a Sorak? Know. Am I a Sorak? Oh, come on. <laughs> You'll see. So anyway, Soraks yeah, what's your story? might be legend, but orcs are quite real, and not just in the Badlands. We're going to see all their background I stumbled stories. across a secret settlement right here in the Principality. Bullshit. <laughs> I traveled here from the east and left the main highway, hoping to save time by traversing the hills. The, the views were magnificent, it. but I should have kept my eye on the path, because it gave way beneath my feet, plunging me oh, no. into Stygian darkness. Oh, no. Do you reckon they've voice acted every single one of these lines oh, with all the different voices you can that's choose? That's pretty cool. Mark. Right, so, wizard. Lighting and light sources. You can use torches to reveal in quiet. You can flammable like, objects like torches. Flames like fireball. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. I read that and at the same time didn't read it. There we go. Light the two torches. Where? Where? Not oh, down here. <gasps> Let's go. Light it. Blessed are the light bringers. Light it. Okay, what's this? Examine the totem. Oh. Orcs history. here? Strange. I love the little dice I noise. What this totem means? Let's head into here. Tutorial healing. If your character casts healing spells like a cleric, press the cast spell button and select a spell in order to recover lost his points. Oh, oh, can we do that? Uh, no, we don't have healing spells. We're a wizard. We can use items though, right? Where's our inventory? Uh... I mean, I'm thinking I can press I, but there should be an... Oh, there it is. Where's the potion? I should have read this. Where's the potion? Pearl. Ration pouch. Food. Scroll kit. Am I missing something? I'm sure it said something about potions. Oh, is it going to be on the chest, maybe? Yeah, there we go. Okay. Okay, healed. Healed. There they are. Orcs? Discretion is clearly the better part oh, of yeah, 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 yeah. Look at them. Yeah, they destroy it, right? You would think this play would have been good on the rogue, like sneaking around, but it is what it is. Activating cautious mode makes you slower. Yeah, we should definitely have done this on the... Uh, on the sneaky boy, I suppose. We didn't have a choice, right? So cautious means stealthier, more aware of hidden objects and creatures.
dun 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 Okay, so let's head back up there then. So we got unknown creature. Orcs are brutish tribal warriors known for their barbaric habits. They live by raiding and looting. Yeah, I've played WoW. I know. I know about orcs. I can turn that off now. Climb that? No. I'm not too sure. Let's go this way. Oh, we could we could use this. I don't know why. What's this? Uh, Abyss moss. Sure. I'm not sure if like if you have like really intense D and D knowledge, maybe a lot of the stuff in here is really familiar. But for me, it's very not. Um, yeah, very, very new to me, a lot of this. Okay, so we've got down behind no them, right? of egress is apparent, fine. I shall wait until they go. These creatures do hunt, right? We're gonna wait until they go. Take a long rest, recover hit points, special abilities and spells. You must take a long rest if you need to go to your party around a cape. A safe place and have one ration of food per party member. Represented by a campfire. Okay, they're also like shown on the map. Okay, so you can prepare spells when you rest. Unprepared spells cannot be cast. Okay. So let's rest it up. Rest six full HP. Prepare spells. You cannot change your list of prepared spells. Oh, you can change it afterwards. Okay. Cool. Okay. Uh, prepare spells. Right. I mean, so you can prepare a few. Let's prepare all those. Fine. I mean, this is the tutorial, right? Did that prepare then? Yeah, so they're all prepared now. Cool. Let's go. Oh, they're gone. Oh, I'm not sure I would have slept so close to a horde of orcs. Orcs have a very distinctive stink. I'm beginning to think Lord Karen might be a mythical creature. We've all told a tale of our travels here. All but one of us. Yes, but I have a good reason for that. It's none of your bloody business. And what's your backstory, Come on, Rogue? Now, don't be a killjoy. We all sang for our supper. Your turn. Fine. You want to know the truth? I stopped on the way here to visit an old friend of mine and discovered he was up to his eyeballs in debt with a lone shark. Oh. That's not good. No. Indeed. He put up a family heirloom as collateral oh, and wanted me to stuff. reacquire it. Because you see, I can be quite stealthy. So necessary. the background is based on the class then. So we learn how to prepare spells on the wizard, big jumps on the on the cleric. Don't really make sense. Um, we fought on the warrior, and now we're sneaking around on the rogue. So okay, I, I, I like that. Use cautious mode to move stealthily. Your nerd noise circle depends on your army type and armor type and stealth skill. Okay. Remain cautious for the whole duration of this mission. Okay. And you must pass a check when trying to open stuff. Oh, what's this? Hold on, hold on, hold on. I can see tracks. Is that because of our identification perks? Human tracks, probably bandits. They look fresh. Okay. Oh, that's very, very cool. So this will give us a, a check, right? Yeah, we know how to use the camera. Uh, thieves tools. What's that used for? Stealing stuff, Liam, I guess. Always thoughtful. Let's follow the tracks, I guess. Enter the fort. Oh, there it is. Pop it open, buddy. There we go. Slide in. Oh, there's a guard on the roof. Roof? Wall, even. There's something there. Uh, 
Lockpicking, try to lockpick, mouse over a locked door. You must have thieves tools in your inventory. Try picking a lock, be proficient with trees tools. Do we lose the tools once we use them? So we've got two tools. Let's try picking the lock. We passed, big good. And we didn't use the tools. That's good, okay. I mean, they're still there, I mean. So we've got two doors we can't use. Let's head this way. Reach the next courtyard. There's a road, there's a guard there. Can we kill him? I suppose it hasn't told us to, so let's stay sneaky. Uh, not sure how to play this. Do we attack or do we go into here? I think we go into here. Pass it. 20. So what do we need? Oh, we needed 10. Okay, we've got 28. Find the treasure room. There's a herb. And a herb. Angry bush. Nice. Uh, there it is. Okay, let's jump in. There's a trap. Okay, so we can probably disarm the trap. You must first detect it. If you try to open with a trap that you haven't detected, you'll find out the trap you trigger it. Try disarming a trap, mouse over it, and left click. You'll need a successful dexterity check. You might trigger it or lock it, or simply to try again. Okay, we should pass this. Yeah, we passed this. No problems. 18. Fabo, right. And then we got to disarm the chest. Oh, we failed. So we took one poison. Okay, how much is our health? 10 out of 11. Uh, a diamond. Oh no, that's the heirloom. And some gold. Great. Now what is it? Just escape? We got that right. Okay, yeah, you can just still open it back up again. Okay, we can't do the others. I guess we leave. It's Liam, I'm right outside, yeah. There this you are, fight. you filthy crook! You? What? You're drunk? Get out of here before I kill you. Think you scare me? Not anymore. A grave mistake. Oh no. Should we go and uh, Liam, jab him? Liam, what are you doing here? I told you I'd take care of it. Some non-player characters may become critical, means if you leave them die, the game is over. If you attack an enemy while in detection, you gain an advantage of surprise. It means you have an advantage of your roll to hit, and your opponent cannot react. If you're a rogue, your attack will be a sneak attack, dealing additional damage. Nice. Right, so they're fighting. Okay, so he missed. Great. So we need to get down here, don't we? So hopefully this is all hidden. I didn't look very hidden. In what way am I hidden? Oh. Uh, I feel like we're not. Okay, maybe maybe that was a stealth attack. I don't know. It was a win anyway. Quest completed. Are you four here to see Lord Karen? I guess so. Oh, so we can choose who to answer. Who's asking? We're not here to get drunk. Maybe we're. Let's Depends on who's asking. Defensive. Well, if you're here for Lord Karen of the Legacy Council, that would be me. Okay. Then we're here at your service, sir. Okay. Very good. Can you tell us more about the job? Well, I suppose it's better if you know what you're doing. What do you want to know? What do you want to know? Everything. We hear this is a mission for the council. Why should all the good answers? What is it exactly? Dear Maraike, you don't know. Oh, you don't know. I'll try to make it simple. But you know, politics. The council includes representatives of the most powerful and influential organizations in the Eastern Kingdoms. It was created to lead a joint effort to explore the Badlands. Badlands equals treasure. Right, we got that. What are the Badlands, really? Simply put, 
They are a monster-ridden, chaotic wasteland nice. that used to be the Elven Empire called Manicow. Wow. It was destroyed about a thousand years ago by the Great Cataclysm. Now, only ruins remain, full of forgotten knowledge, riches, and dangers. Oh my god. Sorry for yawning. It is a Sunday afternoon. I'm very sleepy. Um, what are the organizations you mentioned? The council is, uh, how to put it? A non-governmental non organization. organization. Meaning that state governments are not represented to avoid partisanship. Instead, there are delegates from the Guild of Antiquarians, the Tower of Knowledge, the Arcaneum, and the Circle of Denantar. And yeah, the I'm Church of Anar oh, guarantees oh, fairness. That. There's Led a lot by of lore. Marshal Beric Sunblaze and Oathkeeper Lyra Key. Okay. Yeah, great. I think I think we know enough. I I'm I good. think we know enough now. Yeah, Thank I'm not going to remember any of that. Are you our employer? Are we going to work for you? Not exactly. No. I'll be your contact with the Legacy Council, which you will serve as deputies. That's why we deputies. need to go there and get you sworn in. I'm getting massive Dragon Age vibes. We should go, don't you think? Very well. Well. Come, gather like your things. Robe. You're late for your swearing we in. We should get his robe. Hurry for our up mage. and wait. The story of my life. I have access to the fast travel function, but for now, you'll have to walk a little. Go north, walk up the stairs to the court, and take the stairs west to the council. Right, so. Right click all, move. Cool. Do we want to go hunting around and chatting? I mean, this person here, let's talk to them. We'll talk after you're swearing in. Okay, great, thanks. So we just need to focus on the main mission for now. So north and up the stairs. Is this going to be some you're not allowed in bullshit? No the path destination. The opposite direction. I'm sure it said north and up the stairs. Good start, right? Good start. Uh, head north, take the stairs to the Sunblaze Court, then take the stairs west to the embassies. Unless I'm getting north mixed up. Because there is no north and south on the compass. This yeah, place that's the issue. Bag. That's the issue. There's no north or south on the flipping compass. So there's no yeah, way of knowing it. where north is, right? Is that, that can't be true. Oh, it's there. Oh my god, it's the red dot. Okay. Okay, so yeah, I, I'm just a fool. I'm just a fool. Should we chat to the mayor? Maybe she'll want us to get sworn in first as well. I'm busy. Come yeah. back later. Fabo, let's head over here. It was west, right? Oh, that's south. Oh my god. Directions. It'd be over here, won't it? So, yeah, movement around the city is kind of kind of boring, if I'm being honest. It's kind of slow. Stay in the light, citizens. Kind of long. Can we go through here? No path to destination. Third time reading the journal. Head north, take the stairs to Sunblaze Court. Take the stairs west to the embassies. Right, so we're at the Sunblaze Court now. And take the stairs west to the embassy. If that's north, this is directly north. So west should be here. Snow Alliance Embassy, I guess it's down there. Lord Karad, right, so it's south. Southwest. Cheers for your help, guide. Um, let's head this way. So it should be like Oh, there, there's a marker on the map as well. Flash in. Okay. Nice gardens. Nice gardens. I never thought I'd get so close to the embassy. Oh, so we're picking a main character when we select all. Another look at the cutscene. size of this council hall. So this is what they spend our taxes on. Look. That's cool. Is that the princess? Princess. Nice dress. Wait. Is she leaving? Yep. Apparently so. Then who will administer the oath? I've made her look so stupid. <laughs> um. The maid who empties a chamber pot. Sass. No, we're not as important as that. Perhaps a stable boy. You Such thought sass. it would be the princess? Doesn't she lead the council? No. In this chamber, she's just another delegate. Lady mm -hmm. Keen, the council's oath keeper, is trusted by all. 
Lord Caron. Yes, my lady. Are these your new deputies? They are, my lady. My name is Lyra Keen, oath keeper of the council. Part down. And Just I will be administering your vows. Once sworn in, you will carry the authority of the council wherever you go. Don't your every for a action second. will reflect upon the council's reputation. Remember that, always. Now, please, raise your right hands. Do you, each and all, solemnly swear your lives and allegiance to this council and promise to carry forth our mission yep. to protect our alliance from any who would threaten the common good. Yep. I, I swear. swear. No, I swear. Yep. Excellent. Lord Caron will enter your name into the council's register. Thank you for your service. Congratulations, deputies. Wait, that's it? Easy. Frankly, the speech was long enough for my taste. The formality yeah, so. reflects the solemnity of your oath, but more would probably be immodest. So, the mission. the mission. As I'm sure you know, the council maintains a number of outposts to secure the border between the principality and the marches. One of them is the former imperial fortress, KLM. It's held by some 50 troops under the command of Captain He's Henry. He sends us weekly status reports, or rather, he used to. We haven't heard a word from him in three weeks. Leave immediately for KLM and find out if anyone there is still alive. If Captain cool. Henrik or anyone else is still breathing, bring him back. The council wants a first-hand report. Yes, I will do that. Uh, yeah, yeah, we're good. We're good. Right. We're good. I guess that's that. Eh? Go to KLM. It's find the captain. KLM. He'll probably be dead. Solve it. Ooh, we got a little reputation increase. The five council factions have representatives in care, Kiflen. They can sell you equipment spells and other things. The better your relationship with the faction, the more they have to offer and the lower their prices. However, these factions are in competition with each other, which means you can't please them all. Various subquests will give you opportunities to improve your relations with one faction to another. Keep an eye on the faction selection of the journal. Uh, press the map button to have a location when the waypoint has been found. You can use the fast travel to other places or locations. You can always fast travel to the graveyard cask. Okay, that's the pub. Uh, so what did it say about it? It said in the... Ooh, bestiary. Oh shit, there's a lot of monsters. Okay. Factions. So we just got him through uh, the principality? Yeah. The, the faction will show you favour, joins you in battle. Really? Okay, so we've increased our faction with the principality. But it says they're in, in war with each other. Which one decreases as this one goes up then? Because they're all... Positive or neutral now. So we've got the magic, the circle of Danatar, the Tower of Knowledge, Scavengers, they sound cool. Then the Antiquitarians. Tutorial, yeah, we don't want tutorial. Okay, main quest. So we can map, zoom. We can't zoom out, Australian, but we can fast travel to the Gravekeeper's Flask. Okay, I was expecting a loading screen. That's good. I like that. So it does feel like a fast travel, not like a teleport. I like that a lot. Very much like that. The Legacy Council, level up. Oh no, that's just the mission. Uh, yeah, we've returned here. Now what? Oh, speak to the speak to Carol, the owner. Hello, adventurers. Hi, Carol. What can I offer you? Uh... We need a room. Do we need? Do we need a room? We'd like to stay for the night. Sure. Do we? Just walk up oh, to the shit. suite. Oh shit! So let's take and settle in. A suite? Oh, uh, it's more like a large bedroom, really. Shouldn't have bought but a room. But you know, this is the capital city. We just got fleeced. We just got absolutely ripped off. Oh dear. We did not need this. Oh, we, we've all leveled up though. Everyone's leveled up. Okay, so we've got to level them all up individually. Let's start with the fire. Let's Dean is now a level 2 fighter. Good on you, bro. Unlocked class features. Action surge. Regain a main action immediately. Take a short or long rest to recover this power. You've regained one additional hit die. Ooh. Right. So... Is that is that it? Are we done? So we don't have to pick anything. Okay. Rogie boy. You've gained another hit die. You can take a bonus action of your turns. Cunning. Cool. Uh, Colgar. Regained a hit hit die spherical clerical spell casting slot plus one 
grants you a specialization with a certain kind of magic. Ooh. Ooh. We're going to go shock, right? Yeah, let's go shock. Oh. Lawmaster's quite intriguing. I do like the idea of her being a lawmaster. Advantage on arcana history and investigation ability checks. But then... But then... Magic. <laughs> nah, I want to shoot fireballs and shit with her. So we can pick two new spells to learn. Uh, what's it? Or what's it recommend? Burning hands, and sleep? No. I don't know what it takes when we click that. I think it takes burning hands. I just think what they pick is probably quite important. It takes burning hands and retreat. Yeah. I mean, why? Grant movement points and become ability to dash as a bonus action. I don't think I'd use that. Oh, we already had burning hands. Uh, yeah. So what else did it take? Sleep, identify, false life. Did... I don't know. Let's pick it ourselves, shall we? I feel like this must be important if it keeps telling us to take it. I'm going to take magic mage armor and protection for allies. So prepare spells. Prepare spells, right. So we can take all of those, yeah. I kind of want to take an identify. Oh, you just validate every time. Does it change them? No, okay. So he can prepare spells now. Ooh. Ooh, cleric spells. Clerical spells. I don't remember picking any of these. These were automatic, right? Increase an ally's AC by two. Healing word. Heal an ally. Big. Inflict wound. Deal necrotic damage. Nice. Bane. Reduce the enemy's attack. Yeah. Bless. What does domain mean? Always consider prepared. Oh, so we can always cure and bless. Okay. Okay, that's really cool. Launch a radiant. Oh, yes. Let's take a ranged attack. Detect nearby creatures of good or evil organization. Yeah, I, I kind of like the cleric. Better than I was expecting. Buy some food for the journey. Is that the next mission? This game looks very long, very heavy, but quite rewarding in that you put the time in, you learn the characters, you take the time to read and understand everything. It's going to be a really good adventure. Um, I feel like something like this is probably as good to watch as it is to play because I've spent most of my time looking at menus. So <laughs> I hope you're enjoying the... Uh, I hope you're enjoying the video. There's going to be another part coming soon. I don't know when, but this week, late this week maybe, uh, where we'll put another hour or so into the game, maybe two hours, and just chunk away at it a little bit more. Um, let me know in the comments if you really like this, if, if, it's, if you enjoy it, if you want to see the next part. Yeah, so let me know. Other than that, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.